All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Block Shrewd video. And guys, in today's video, we're gonna be checking out another fruit, okay? And in the last video, we actually mastered Control Fruit. And I seen you guys comment, there's actually something special about this fruit. I thought it wasn't that good because of the range being really, really small. But you guys told me that you can make this range bigger somehow. Like, okay, so apparently you gotta like hold the ability down. So I'm just tapping it, right? So that's it, right? That's it, take a look. And now once we hold it in, Bro, it's so much bigger. Like, it's twice as big. And yeah, now I see why this fruit is so good. Guys, imagine this. I need to go all the way up there, right? And we have an ability, Teleport. Now, look how big this range is, okay? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Bro, I can go all the way over here. And this is just amazing. Like, I can teleport all over this area. Like, now I get it, all right? Now I get it. Imagine you're being hunted in the area. You can just teleport over there. And you can just keep running. Because the ability reloads so quickly. Like, nobody's gonna be able to get you. Anyway, guys, enough talking about control fruit. Because in today's video, we're gonna be mastering a fruit that's very interesting. I've actually never had this fruit. Like most of the fruits. But in today's video, we're mastering the spirit fruit. And bro, look at this fruit. Oh my, what the? It has a face. And it's one side, like, kind of ice. And then the other side is, like, dark reddish. It's like an angel and a demon. So, yeah, I don't know what to expect from this fruit. But we're gonna eat it in today's video and see what it is, all right? Oh, we're not gonna eat it, okay? But first, we're gonna try... Wait, what is... What is up with you, Star? What? Why are you a skeleton? Bro, I ate the skomoji fruit. Which fruit do you mean? Wait, let me check, let me check. Okay. Oh, you ate the revive fruit. Oh my god, bro. Look what happened to me, I see you died and now you're a skeleton. Is that how it works? I guess so. But hey, come raw fruit. Maybe you actually get a fruit now, okay? Come on, can we do a back to back to two time back to back champion by rolling another mythical fruit? It already happened with dough fruit, but come on, please. Those are one of the worst fruits. Okay, that's okay. It's never gonna happen, bro. We are not becoming the two time, I guess, huh? But anyway, let's go and buy this fruit, okay? And as you can see, right here it is, okay? It's below control and it has the same mastery, bruh. Guys, that is so much. Why do you make me do this. Uh, I mean, I guess I'll do it for you guys. So I'm expecting some likes, okay? Like the video and subscribe. And I need to spend Robux to buy this fruit. <sighs> Come on. You know what, guys? I guess I'll do it, all right? And there you guys go. Permanent spirit activated. But wait, what is happening? Why am I... What are these balls floating around me? What is this? I have a blue ball and a, like, a demonish ball? Uh, Star, do you even know what this is? Like, what is this? Are these my pets or something? Can they do anything? Can they attack you? Yeah, I got pets. Exactly. Uh, I mean, can they attack you? Come here. Wait. If I grab spirit, look at that. We have spirits and it's charging up something. What is happening? It says spirits eight and it's still moving. Bro, I've never seen something like this. Wait, what is this? And it caps at nine, as you can see. Um, He says you can M1. Wait, really? Wait, this is such an interesting fruit already. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, so I can M1, okay. Uh, Wait, what did I do? Uh, what is that? A star? I guess I just spawned something. I don't, I have no clue what it's doing, okay? It doesn't do any damage. Let's just go again. Uh, what? Yo. Oh, what? What is that? The frog is attacking you. The magical frog with like mushrooms on it. Oh, and if you spawn it, your spirits go down. So look at that. Now I have eight. Once it's at the end, it reloads my spirits. That's actually really interesting. I wonder what this fruit is gonna bring us, okay? But first, let's go and try this first ability, okay? Frost, fire, grass. All right, three, two, one, and go. Oh. What was that? Did I froze you? Wait, wait, let me try that again. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, so we do this, and then I kind of... I freeze you up or something? It does 3.6k damage, so it's pretty good damage. You froze me. Oh, I froze you? Okay, that's pretty good, I guess. But how hard is it to hit? Like, you can do this? I guess you can, like, quite easily hit that. That is not bad for the first ability. I kind of like that. Oh, wait, guys, I already know. This is a cold spirit, right? It's like a stormy spirit, and that's why I froze him, right? Maybe the next ability is gonna be from the demon spirit. Well, I kind of don't know, okay? So let's go and get the second ability, which is 150 mastery. All right, guys, we gotta go to K-Queen because obviously we need some mastery, right? And this is the only place we're gonna get that because there's no other way into getting that. But guys, wait, can I just spam M1? Like, what if I spam it? What if I just spam it? Oh, wait. Um, oh. Oh, so the red part only does damage, I'm guessing? These piggies that I spawned in didn't do much, and I spawned them whenever it was blue. Oh, so everything I spawned in, which is red, is gonna, like, defend me? All right, I just spawned everything red, and let's see. 
Bro, what are these trees? Like, what are these ugly trees, bro? Yo, it's stunning the boss for me. That is actually kind of insane. But it doesn't last for that long. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be able to defeat K-Queen with just these spirits, okay? Let's see, come on. Spam, 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 spam. And so you can just stun the boss and make it way easier to defeat. But guys, I also feel a little bit faster. What is happening? Why, why am I so much faster? Look at these dashes. These are, like, super, super fast. All right, guys. As you can see, K-Queen is all the way down to, like, 10% HP. And now I'm gonna read out some spirits and see if I can kill it with just the spirit. Is that even possible? Just to be honest, I don't know. But we're gonna try it either way, okay? Let's spawn some. Oh my god. Oh, no, no, no. Hey, we only want the red ones, okay? Red, red, red. Come on, there you go. And are you gonna kill him? No way. Come on, killer. Killer, come on. Come on. Mushroom, do something. Frog, do... Oh my god, they despawned. Come on, we got a few more right here. Come on, there you go. Are they doing anything? Oh, it's poisoning. Is this a new gas fruit? Oh my god, we got her. That was insane. Wait, my spirit fruit killed her herself. I was just clicking around, and I didn't have to do anything. And we just unlocked the next ability, which is Sky Ruler and Wrath of Raw. So let's go and try it out. All right, so first, I'm gonna do the 75 ability, because this one is, I guess, lower, right? So, all right, three, two, one, and can fly. It's not that fast, but it's pretty good, actually. It doesn't do any damage, though. And why am I flying on the red ball and not the blue ball? I was expecting to fly on the angel ball, right? Because angels can fly. Well, I guess demons can also fly. That's pretty cool. But now let's go and try this next one. 150. Wrath of Raw. Alright, guys. 3, 2, 1, and... Uh, that didn't even hit him. What was that? But let's go and try it again, I guess. So... What? Wait, I don't understand. Whenever I'm aiming on him, it just goes behind him. If I do it here, it just goes on the ground. Um, okay, let's go and try it again. Let's go and try it from closer distance like that. Oh, now it hit. Oh, what the? What the? Yo, 6.5k? That just erased your HP. What? All right, I have a feeling this is a really good fruit already. Like, we have an M1. We can spawn, like, a lot of these things. There you go. Attack star over here. Stun him. We can freeze him over here. And, oh. He's already dead? What? Uh, okay, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to kill you. Um, <laughs> what is this fruit? This fruit is insane. Right, now I'm even more excited about Wrath of Shu and End of Times. And I was right. It was a demon ability. Look, it was like a, like a fire ability, right? And this one is a freezing ability. So the next one should be also a freezing ability? I guess so. Let's go and master it. So, K-Queen, come here. You're about to, uh, uh, she's not here. I need to respawn. Right, there she is. Okay, so let's try the ability on her. There you go. Freeze her up a bit. There you go. Do this. Okay, this is insane. We can already use some crazy combos on her. And we can spawn some spirits. Yeah, there you go, K-Queen. I hope you like that, all right? I hope you like being stunned like that. There you go. Now let's fight her. Come on. I wonder what these other things do. Like, oh, wait. Is it healing me? Wait. Wait, what was that? I think it was healing me or something. I right, guess look at that. Spirit just got her all the way up to like 1 HP, all right? And I'm almost dead. So I should be able to spawn some healing units like that. There you go. And I should get healed, okay? And kill her with the last ability right here. That should be it. And there you go, guys. We got her. And let's see how much magic we got, okay? We got up to 188, but we need 250. So I guess I'll see you guys then. Because the grinding part is usually kind of boring. Guys, okay, K-Queen is about to die. And I think we should get have a mastery, okay? So we do this. We do a little bit of that. And, uh, okay. Yo, what the? All right, K-Queen. You really think you can... Oh, <laughs> she died from my crows, bro. <laughs> and we unlocked just enough for the next ability. Look, 250. New skill available. And we got Rat of Shoe. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. We unlocked a shoe ability or something. Yeah, I don't know. Let's go and try it out. Because I'm excited, right? I already really like this fruit. I don't know about you guys. What do you guys think about this fruit so far? Oh, there he is. Okay, let's go and try it out, okay? Rat of Shoe. Okay, I'm about to send a shoe in your head, all right? Anyway, let's go and try it out, okay? Three, two... One. What the? Uh. What? What was that? All right, I don't know what that was, but I need to try that again, all right? So first of all, I'm holding it in, right? So what? I'm on the ball. Okay, I'm riding the ball, and then I can release it, and... What does it do? I don't understand. It does a little bit of damage. I think the X ability was way better, because look at this. If I hit the X ability... Bro, it does 6,000 instantly. 7.6. Bro, bro. That just erased his HP, bro. This C ability, the shoe one, is kind of disappointing. Am I doing something wrong, guys? I don't know, because... That's pretty much all it does. Yeah, I don't know about this one. But now we need to unlock the last one, which is End of Times. Okay, I'm excited for this one. But this one is 350. So I'll see you guys in like 124 hours. Okay, I'm joking. But it's gonna take a long time, right? So I'll be right back. Oh, but wait a minute, guys. A fruit has spawned. So I kind of want to see what this fruit is. It's right over here, I'm pretty sure. So we're gonna try it out right here. And I haven't seen it yet. 
It's a uh, chop fruit. Bro, why do I always get garbage fruits? Uh, this fruit is going into the ocean, okay? Yeah, some shark will pick it up, all right? Some shark, one day, all right? Wait, what if you're a shark race and you can actually pick up fruits from the sea? That would be kind of interesting. Anyway, back to grinding. Now, guys, if you usually have trouble fighting Gay Queen, just get Gov4 and Buddha and check what I can do with this boss. I transform. All I do is just do this. I get her to the nearest wall and now I just dash. And I just dash in the wall. I just dash in the wall. So my crows are getting activated and they can attack, okay? Now you can see my HP going down, but obviously my stats are maxed out. So I can use Soul Guitar to heal myself up. And I can just, yeah, I can just spunk at the boss pretty much. Well, I'm getting low a little bit right here. But you guys can see what I'm talking about, right? Maybe the boss will do like the abilities that are getting you in flames, which is very unlucky. But usually they don't do it, alright? And you can just literally spunk your Gay Queen. And there you guys go. Gay Queen is dead almost. And it's literally been like 30 seconds. Now we switch over to Spirit and... And boom, there you go. Bada beam, bada boom, and she should be that soon. One more ability, or maybe two. There you go, come on. That should be it, come on. What? Did I miss that one? I guess I did. And there you go. We're all the way up to 292, but we need 350. So yeah, be right back. All right, guys. Cake Queen is all the way down to like 1 HP. Come on. Can we like combo her with this? Come on, please. This. All right. Then this. And then this. Oh my God, bro. All right, that's insane. Okay. And we got all the way up to 338, which means we only need 12 more masteries. So one more boss, I guess. And a few more NPCs. And we should be all Gucci. Let's respawn one more time. And come on. Come on, your Cake Queen. Your time has come up. Okay, you're about to die for the last time. Well, hopefully, okay? Let's go do that, do that, and do that. All right, one of the last kills, she's so low. What is she walking? Bro, what was she doing, okay? Enough of jokes. You're about to die right here, right there, and there you go. 345, okay? Can we finish it off with normal NPCs, maybe? All right, this should be the last NPC. Come on, come here. Bro, I missed. And there you go. New skull baitable. Bro, finally, man. That took me at least 30 minutes. And I'm not even joking, right? I wish I was joking, okay? My Robux is hurting, okay? Anyway, we unlocked end of times. And we're about to test it, okay? It's 350 mastery. So I'm expecting a bunch of stuff. Or a really good ability, right? So three, two, one, and go. Yo. Oh my god. What the? What the? Shoo! Uh. Were you for HP star? There's no way, right? Guys, this last ability was insane. I don't know what that was, but we have to try it again. It looked to me that my angel and my demon created a whole beam to just destroy everything in the path. So let's just go and try it again, okay? All right, three, two, one, and go. Oh my, bro. What is that? explosion bro that was insane guys so the beam doesn't do that much damage but the explosion after that yeah you can see it it took like a half hp let's go and try it again okay let's see let's see let's see where's star i don't even see star anymore bro i just see eleven thousand damage and yo wait do you get stunned or no yes if you hit me i get stunned oh so do it does get stunned wait that is actually insane guys this might be one of the most annoying npcs i'm not even joking i didn't even attack you why are you walking behind me okay you know what he asked for it okay he asked for it yeah, take some of that and take some of this. There you go. But boy, spirit fruit is one of the craziest fruits, okay? I don't know why, but it just keeps getting better and better. And plus that, you have a sick demon ball and an angel ball next to you, which is actually kind of cool. Now you can see from a distance if someone is a spirit user. All right, guys, I give this fruit a 9.5 out of 10 because this is like amazing, all right? And you have this unique spirits thing, which you can like spawn spirits in. That is insane, bro. Which have different abilities attacking like... It just does free damage. It's pretty good. I guess, comment down below. Would you use spirit fruit? Yes or no? And which fruit should I do next, okay? Like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys.